when you're putting in the right ascension and declination, yeah. how do you move into the next part of the tab? Tab. Okay, perfect. Yep, tab. Because if I press enter, it's um, it skips it. Um, I'm just going to call it eagle because uh, yeah, no maybe that doesn't fit in. So it's 1818. 18. Oh, no, tab. I really hope it's 1818. 18. Does anybody double check that? Yeah. Um, no, sure, do you want me okay. to just open Stellarium and I'll find it? That's right, is it? My name's Trace Cantwell, I'm from Cork and I'm studying physics and astrophysics in UCC. We're up a mountain in Tenerife at the, um, the IAC Observatory and we're currently, well mostly what we're doing, we're looking at um, an object called SWIFT and we're trying to measure its period. It's, um, SWIFT is a black hole binary, so that means it's just it's a black hole with a star orbiting it and the black hole is kind of like sucking stuff out, out of the star. So we're just trying to measure its period. So, um, so that just that just involves pointing the telescope at it and um, taking exposures all through the night. And we're going to do that for a couple of days because um, they thought originally its period was about two days, or no, two hours, I think. But now it seems to be longer, so we're trying to measure it over a long period of time so we can be more certain of um, what its period is. No, 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 it's okay. Just start the exposure. Are you sure? Yeah, go, go, go. Fire it. Go fire it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, do we need to set the focus? Paul. Yes, we do. Um, yeah. from, from the one from Mass Mike, that was like 4,000, wasn't it? Yeah, that's okay. Was it 4,000? I think it was 4, So the first night we came, we were, we kind of started about, I think we started about 8 o'clock, because you have to wait for it to get dark. And so then you, um, you do the first bit of calibration with the telescope, uh, just for the first few minutes. And then the first night we were kind of here till about 3 o'clock, because um, there was just a problem with one of the programs, which is now working, so, so it's fine. But um, yeah, so we now though we're kind of staying till about half six, seven o'clock until the kind of the sun goes down, and we spend most of that just um, taking exposures of the the black hole and any other sources that we feel might be interesting, and then we also do some of the data reduction on the data we get, just to to calibrate it and um, get something usable, and so we're doing that till about half six, seven, by which time we are very very tired. And then we go back to bed till, um, well, I got up at two o'clock this morning, so. Uh, and then we just sort of lay about for a while because we're still half asleep. UCC is in the city, so I'm not used at all to being able to actually like see the stars in the sky. And actually you can actually see the Milky Way, which is, which is really cool, seeing as I grew up in the city and that's just not visible in the city at all. So it's um, it's really out of the way and it's it's really pretty and it's just, it's nice and I've never got to actually do any, like proper observing with the proper telescope before. So it's 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 nice to try it, because I've done other bits of astrophysics before, but that's dealing with data that's already been taken. So it's it's nice to also kind of get um, some experience taking the data. It's uh, it's quiet, it's beautiful, the sunsets are amazing and the, the sky is amazing at night and it's just lovely. 